it all started with inviting friends over for tea and vinyl, and it ended up being a, a real enriching, warm experience. I get pretty crafty with it. I can kind of just look at my herb cabinet, and if I have a concept in mind, I can turn it into gold. I'm Mike the Tea Guy, and I run Craft Tea, herbal tea blends, handmade in Philadelphia, where I blend together music and tea to give you a good vibe. I used to travel the world, had like a corporate gig doing sales enablement, and I was going to places that had good teas. Some of my blends, I try to do my version of their teas. Japan, China, Korea, they all have like a very zen-like vibe. You go down to Latin America, you go to Buenos Aires and Argentina, and there's just romance in the air and there's a nice buzz to it, so I like to recreate the buzz. Psycho Kitty, the Wissahickon Walker, the Gritty Tea is real popular. These are gonna be more of an alcohol alternative than a coffee alternative. A lot of them involve nerve tonics. So they really just decompress, get some stress out, and kind of chill out. My specialty is unique, relaxing concept blends, so things that are based off of graffiti, vinyl, or musicians like Wu-Tang or the Grateful Dead. All the teas have vinyl pairings. Vinyl has a much full, warmer sound to it, and that just pairs perfectly with tea. It kind of blew my mind that it actually made me feel better and different and helped me really play music. Music is such a, a rich source of inspiration, it really gets the juices going, the right music at the right time. Just like tea can really elevate the mood, elevate the spirit, and really get you going to where you need to be. I would love to make people feel good, you know, without it tasting too bad. <laughs>